morning, everybody. Morning. Good morning. We, we are blessed with a wonderful day today, uh, unlike the last week or so. So I guess we can't complain about the weather. We're joined here to, together today during Memorial Day ceremony so that we may have the opportunity to celebrate and honor the many men and women of our military who died while protecting our nation. Today, we have the reserve and the guard being the kind of the point of the spear. Whereas in the past, it's always been the, the regular Air Force, the regular Army. And I think a big thanks should go out to our guardsmen and our reservists. Thank you. There are no words that can properly reflect the magnitude of what they accomplished and the amount of endearing love, respect, and honor that we hold deep in our hearts for them. It is a fact that freedom is not free. Throughout our nation's history, there's been a heavy cost involved in, in preserving our way of life. We as a nation have soldiered that cost, and for the many generations of men and women who fought and died for freedom's sake, it came to them not as a burden, but as a duty. Regretfully, the sacrifices of our comrades are sometimes forgotten or disregarded, especially by those who have gained the most from it. History and current events have proved that the heavy fist of tyranny and terror would prevail over many countries that are enjoying relatively recent freedom and democracy, if not for those we honor today. As Colin Powell once so eloquently stated, we have gone forth from our shores repeatedly over the last hundred years and put wonderful young men and women at risk, many of whom who have lost their lives and have asked for nothing except the ground to bury them in. As we speak of the present and the distant past, it is up to us to make sure the legacy of our nation's war is passed on from this generation to the next and then to all generations beyond. We must ensure that the youth of tomorrow have an awareness and understanding of whom it is they should likewise honor and exactly why they should honor them. Let us leave here today knowing that our destiny as a free people is entirely up to us. Let every deed and act of each of our days be guided by the memory of those who gave their lives for our future freedoms, and may their sacrifice continue to inspire us and fill us with hope. God bless our military, and God bless America. Thank you. <laughs>